The hunt is on. Yo, 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 what's good, guys? It's your boy, Beegs. I'm back with another video. I hope you guys have been good, and I also hope you guys have been enjoying the somewhat consistent upload schedule. It's been good to be uploading again. I have been playing a lot of League, so I thought, hey, why why, why not? Why not just upload some videos? But yeah, I hope you guys have been enjoying it. Today, I'm playing on my Kaisa only accounts, one of them anyway, and uh, we're going to be, we're in Platinum MMR right now, and this is my actually my unranked to Masters account. Um, so the, the last two videos that I uploaded, um, have actually been the unranked to master series. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys have been enjoying those. Um, this one will be a little bit more educational, um, than the last two, but just cause I feel like doing it. I, like I said, I'm going to do these every once in a while. I'm not going to do them all the time. Maybe, maybe, maybe like once or tw once or twice a month at most, at most. I'm not very good at them. So yeah, but either way today we're playing into a pretty hard lane. We have a thresh, so that's awesome. This is a really good lane. Uh, really good support for Kai'Sa. And we're against Milio uh, Lucian. Pretty hard lane for Kai'Sa. Um, he, you really can never trade with this guy. And you guys may be asking, Beagle, why the fuck do you have Hella Blades instead of Lethal Tempo? Well, it's simple. All right, Lethal Tempo is really good against Lucian because you're not, he takes very short bursty trades and uh, you're, if you take Lethal Tempo, you'll pretty much never be able to stack it up against him. It's a good um, and B, I'm actually bringing back an old OP build that you guys may, may or may not remember back in like season 10-ish, season 11. Or season 11, sorry. <clears throat> um, it's Gale Force Collector uh, Rapid Fire Cannon, i.e. or Navori, actually. I'm sure you guys remember this. It's in my older videos. It used to be the best Snowball and Kaisa build in the game. It's really good. Overall, an amazing build. What the? Kill him here? He does? Oh. Oh, we gotta focus on our wave. So, main goal is... Focus on not getting poked out too much by Milio. Double shield. Oh, did my flash start hook or flay? He started flay. It's fine. Should have played him though. Maybe he did. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention. Mainly just don't want to take too much poke from Lucian Q through minions. We're gonna try to get level two first. That's fine. It's a really good trade for my Thresh. Okay, we should get level two first. Oh, he could have kept walking, but it's okay. So we have level two first, and now we want to slow push it, right? I'm, gonna, I'm trying to teach you guys how to play into a tough lane. We do have Thresh, so it's not as tough as it should be, but it's still pretty tough because Lucian's trading pattern is just really, really good for Kai or against Kai'Sa. And uh, Milio Prox is passive with Milio passive, like Milio fucking burn passive. It's really broken, so you really just got to be careful playing into this. But yeah, mainly just don't want to take poke on Q from minions from Lucian. I'm going to shove this because I can't really rotate to this right this second. I'm just going to focus on crashing the wave. Again, we, we really don't want to play inside of minions because that's how we get Lucian queued. So yeah. Like I said, this is like plat 3-ish, plat 2-ish MMR. So yeah, the, the climb's going pretty good. I think I'm around 70% win rate right now. Like 68 or something. But yeah, it's going pretty good. Um, I play like two or three games on it every couple days or so. And I don't play much. I don't record much off off the account so yeah basically what you're seeing is what what i'm playing see hooks like that are bad we don't want him to hook like that because if they really wanted to they could engage on us after that we got to be really careful with hooks like that man oh he made it there in time oh trees it's fine i have another ward oh, I missed them. ward that you walk at them you just walk up at them bro oh very good Wait for his flash. A W here. Q. Good trade, good trade. Flash heal. Really good, really good. Oh shit. Oh, he's dead. What the hell? Brand ghosted down here, bro. He's crazy. I think I wasted heal. I shouldn't have healed her. I should have just let her die. What? We should just win lane for free now, though. Oh, man. I'm not going to let this guy back. That's good. That's good. Free call here. This wave should freeze. Hopefully this minion doesn't stop my back. Nice. By this, 
we want to we're gonna hightail it back to lane as fast as we can, fast as we can. I don't know why he's still there, bro. You could just recalled, but it's it's all good. Oh man, now he's not gonna get a recall off. What is he doing? Oh, did he did Milio stop his back? Maybe is that why he put this little face? Maybe I can't go my uh, the Gale Force build because I kind of have to carry this game. I'm not gonna lie. This world is changing. Good lantern by Thresh. Pretty much want to zone him off the wave. Milio recalled, but Thresh didn't. So like, we're actually behind. Kind of sucks, but. It is what it is. But as you can see, I, I recall there to set up a freeze because we had more minions than them. So I recall, I deny them CS, and I also, uh, the wave doesn't move. Very good, very good. Oh, I guess I should have queued. It's okay to miss one, though. I don't mind using Lucian, Lucian using W like this, though. It's a big part of his kit. You can clear that, bro. Don't worry about it. Clear that sheet. I'm glad, kind of glad that didn't hit because there's no way we could have been able to kill them. Lucian, uh... Would have just up traded me there. Yeah, he can't back here. He has to help me shove the wave, and then we can both recall. I'm not gonna recall after. I can just get a long sword. Oh, I queue too late. Alright, now we can recall. Now we can recall. I'm down to recall as well. It's no big deal. If I get another long sword, I'll be ahead of him. Okay, buy this, and again, same thing, it runs straight back to lane. Our Thresh really needs to back. Our Karthus is, you know, doing the I word, man. He's doing the I word right now. <laughs> Let's check Lucian's AD here. 102 minus at 112, so I have 10 more AD than him off of this recall. Oh, this could be a kill. I'm hoping. Oh my god, he's out. Oh, you know, he's dead. There's no reason for me to rotate to that, I don't think. Nice, good job. You guys may be wondering, why won't I shove? Why shouldn't I shove? Are we still chasing this? Okay. Guess we are. Oh, the late flash. There's no point in me going. It's a waste of time. Alright, now we're gonna shove. I was gonna say, you guys may be asking why I'm freezing this. This is to deny more CS because he's gonna walk back to lane. But uh, yeah, he's dead, so now we shove him. Kais is really good at shoving lane. That was a fiesta that I wasn't there for, which kind of sucks. Because I would have got really fed off of it, but oh well. Can't make them all. I also didn't make a bad decision by recalling there. Recalling there is actually the right decision because we don't know what's going to happen there. I have no idea that, that a skirmish is going to break out like that. Sorry to miss these. We just got to really get this crashed. Nice. We should be able to get one plate and he loses like three CS here. Nice. Yeah, he lost three CS. I don't have a ward or else I'd ward right here. The reason you ward right here or right here in the bush is for to watch for lane ganks, right? Stay alert. Stay aggressive. Oh, I thought that ward was somebody. What the hell? <laughs> so he's uh he's even with me now. He has 112. Oh no, I'm 115 because I'm uh, level on him. I'm gonna ping that I have an ult and he doesn't. Come on, let's go. Vision for my jungler. They probably just know my thresh is here. He should be out. He can just jump over the wall. It's just shoving to me, so we want this to stay like this. We should just miss some CS for that. So, like, look at the CS difference we have. Because he keeps moving and I'm not. My thresh needs to like walk in. You know. I don't want to shove this and break this crazy good this crazy good slow push because he's gonna miss so much for it so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have my thresh go say hey yo go help them and I'm gonna freeze I'm gonna freeze here because this will deny him so much gold it doesn't look like they're rotating that but I'm also gonna see how see my positioning here in the in the, in the lane here I'm playing up towards the drag just in case I need to rotate so I'll make it there before them right so luckily nothing happens so Look how much he missed. A moving target lives longer. I don't know why he's playing so scared. He could have hooked him there. The, uh, Familia. But as you can see, the wave is still shoving towards us. 
He has not broken the, the slow push at all. This is why I survive. Look at look at the CS difference. Look, just because of wave management. I haven't even killed them. You see? Just because of wave management. Can you stop auditing the wave, man? My Thresh auditing the wave is kind of griefing me, though. It's still slow pushing, though, even though he, he kind of fucked it. But as you can see, look how important wave management is, right? And since I have a Thresh, they have to really be scared to walk up. The team's doing good. Stop them from walking up to the wave, man. Oh my. My Thresh, what he should be doing is he should be walking past the wave to zone them, but like. He should be walking right here. He should be just pacing back and forth right here when there's no creep wave here. Lucian misses a whole cannon. Um, well, she almost died. Yeah, this is an un this freeze is not breaking at all. Look at this. I'm, uh, this is how you win through wave management right here. Oh, cute side guarantee. This is how you win through wave management, unironically. Look at his CS. Look at mine. Okay, he's out. I was gonna rotate up to that, but. So we're gonna keep the we're gonna keep the lane right here. Walk it to the bush. Boom. Yeah, I haven't even killed him once. I know this is kind of boring, guys, but this is like very basic skills in League of Legends that can win you games easily. I haven't killed anybody, and I'm just hard winning lane. Look at this. Almost 50 more CS than this guy. This is very basic skills in League of Legends that like can win you games. You don't need to be mechanically insane to win games, right? So what we're going to do here is we're going to tank this, tank this. It should be my Thresh, but since he's a solo queue support, he doesn't know any better. Walk to the bush, use a biscuit. We don't want to fight. We do not want to fight. They're stronger than us by technicality. So now they can probably break the freeze. They backed and I haven't. I need my Thresh to uh, come out of the bush now. I'm gonna play safe here. And I'm gonna RW in. Boom. Confirm the kill. Nice. I'm just gonna miss those three. That's fine. So as you can see, if you look at the uh, the CS difference here, I'm about to hit over 50 more CS than him. We're gonna get one plate. One plate. <laughs> one plate. We're gonna grab this wave as well. We're gonna pot just in case since they're all diving our guy top. Grab one wave. Then we're gonna recall. And we're gonna have Q evolve as well. Just shove this. Boom. Look at my CS lead. I have 50 more CS than this guy. Just by lane fucking. Just by wave management, guys. Okay. So, oh, this this is a really informational video, actually. So we're gonna have Q evolve here, right? Boom. Um, we want Dirk, so boom. And then also on top of this, we're gonna go ahead and buy uh, this, and then boots as well. I Hello. Than there I we go. Bet. Boots. This game is actually a lot closer than it's meant made out to be. Our our Panth is really strong, but that's about it. Like nobody else is like really doing amazing except for me. I'm not fed off of kills. I'm fed off of wave management like look look just look look guys if you guys are not learning from this video i don't know what the hell like the, the rank one kaisa teaches you like wave management this is insane this isn't guys this isn't fucking bronze this isn't like fucking silver it's plat which is also extremely low elo but some of you people are plats okay some people some of you most of my viewers are plat from what i've heard so this is something you guys can do in your elo yes it works better because i have a thresh but like at the end of the day, if you have a life lead like that, you can always freeze, and if they walk up, you can punish them. I'm gonna shove this. We can't hold the freeze because our thresh is in here, so there's no reason to skip it. That's probably a control ward, and I don't want to clear it and die. Just gonna get some vision. I'm gonna walk over here with my Nidalee to help her just in case. That goes top. gonna help her there's, there's like i said if i walk up to this wave i die or i like get get killed right look at my look at my xp advantage too we're gonna help with this too i'm down to sack this wave i'm down to sack this 100 percent. it's fun look up because i have such a big lead oh, lead in lane cs wise so 40 cs on him should be a free drag echo's not here what bro he didn't have, wait, we didn't have smites? Uh, wait, 
Wait, what did he smite? Oh! Okay, nice. Okay, well, I guess that's my bad. I should have held tab and looked for smite. That's 100% my fault. That, that's that's more my fault than our junglers, honestly. I don't know what he smited. You can't trust your solo queue junglers like that, guys. I, I didn't think he smited anything, because what would he smite, right? Watch for the Q through the wave. That's Lucian dash. That's really good. Auto Q and walk away. W him here as well. Really good trade. It would have done way more damage if he didn't have bone plating, by the way. So now we want to shove this again. It sucks that I'm going Gale Force and the tank is this fed. I don't have lethal tempo to, to shred him either. Oh, we'll try our best. Fall through with the build. We could still go our uh, our Kraken build. That goes top. Nothing, no reason to be scared of these motherfuckers. Auto Q, then run out. Boom, you see the trade. Look how good that trade is. W this. Miss. Fuck. Typically, I don't condone Wing to poke like this, but since I'm like getting so much free damage like this, yeah. No reason not to. We just want to pressure them off the tower so we can take this tower, because we're guaranteed to take this no matter what. Yeah. They're giving it. Nice. Void rule number one. Don't die. And I'm, the reason I'm doing this is I want to deny them these last creeps. I'm Tiad denying him these creeps. He might get one of them. Yeah. Tiad denied him those creeps by using the tower to let the tower kill them. You see how important that is? Just overall pushing my lead. Just overall pushing my lead by 50 CS. Pantheon's winning. Pantheon R, we could just dive them. There's no reason for me to stay. I have Gale Force. I'm gonna go top now. Um, I'm gonna go Gale Force. Fuck it. We're following through with the OG build. Why not? Um, we're gonna buy this. And we'll buy this. He needs to let me go top, man. Please, please let me go top. Okay. Well. Guys, your solo queue teammates, obviously this guy's like tilted or full muted, so he's not going to let me go top. Um, so instead, we're just going to play mid. That's really bad that our pants just gave away $1,000. You're not going to let me get red? Oh my god. Oh. Very interesting. And our Panthalt is way too far away. Not gonna kill anybody here. Yeah, I can't really fight in all those creeps. My ISO Q. This build is all about like ISO Q with Dirk. Okay, we're gonna shove this next one. We see Milio back, we see Lucian bot. Karthus is dead here for huge. Rand's top. This leaves us free here. Okay, we get the full wave. Oh, yeah, our main goal is just getting collector right now. We really need collector. We're gonna run top here. We should be top originally. Fuck, I don't we do we sack next top? I think we sack. I will show it how to live. I think we give this. I, I'm, I'm telling my team to give because I need items. So instead, I'm going to go ahead and grab, like, the CS. Just that goes here. What the heck? Their whole team's here. What the heck? I'm going to stop this guy's back. I'm going to stop Echo's back. It's way more important. That goes back and stop. I can one shot this guy, I think. If, he ISO, if I get ISO key on him. I really wish my Thresh wasn't here so I could be getting solo XP, but it's okay. Get this tower for free. We have our next item. Guys, just give it, man. It's not a big deal. 
It's okay. It's only second drag, guys. Oh, just give it. It's okay. Give the drag, man. It's it's all right. I'm gonna check his whole whole jungle. Maybe I can come to this now. Maybe yeah, we can come to this now. Be late, but we can actually get some kills here. My E over. I'm gonna wait for the E over. Oh my god, he didn't even mean to hit me. Nice. Not bad. Oh, am I dead? Woo! Thresh Lantern saved me, I think. I walked into the Thresh Lantern to get the shield. Oh my god, I could have played that a little bit better. Dude, okay, so I flashed. My flash may look grief, but I honestly thought the Brandon was going to cue me, but he cued my Thresh for some reason. Oh, I forgot my blue ward. Don't forget your blue ward, folks. Blue ward. I thought he was going to fucking... I thought he was going to fucking cue me. I don't, why did he cue my Thresh, guys? What the hell? <laughs> did you see that? He cued my Thresh. I flashed to the side to, like... Dodge the thresh or the the, the brand queue. I'm gonna grab our jungler drafters. I'm just gonna meet my jungler because I don't care what he says anymore. I need farm. League with our Nidalee with gold is easily the least like the worst champion in the game. She's such a she's such a dog shit champ. Okay, now I actually do a lot of damage because I have collector. I do a lot of damage to anything that's not. Oh my god, their whole team's here. Look how, look how useless my this Nidalee is with like, gold. You see what I'm saying? She has like all this gold and she's not doing anything with it. Fuck, man. This probably wasn't worth it, right? It's okay, though. We got E-Evolve, so... I think I should have ran up here instead of try to kill the... Solution, but yeah, you see how useless this character is with gold. This is why this is why you always want to take everything from Nidalee's. Oh no, don't go for this. What the fuck? <laughs> uh, interesting. Okay, yeah. It's a good thing we muted her because uh, we're definitely taking all of her jungle farm. Like you, you cannot trust your solo queue junglers. I the reason I gave him the last red is so I wouldn't tilt him. That's it. There's no other reason. They're not gonna do it because they don't have fucking Echo doesn't wait. Echo doesn't have mana. Kill the Echo. Echo should be dead here. I gotta get out of the pit somehow. Oh my god! Oh, I'm out of here. Fuck this next move. So next on our list is definitely IE, I think. I think we go IE, not Navori this game. I don't think Navori is very good. It might be. Honestly, I think Navori probably is better. Setting up for drag. We want to stay mid and shove one more here. Oh, shit. What the fuck? I had to use Gale Force there. That's that's Nornal. That's a really big ult. But I don't have Gale Force now, so it's like really bad. We need to CC chain the fuck out of, out of Echo. Oh, that is not a good card. This death. Death. What the fuck? We can win this now for sure. I have both sums. Okay. We're carrying the game. Let's fucking go. We can't do Baron. Shove mid and bot here. The hardest snowballing kites to build is back, guys. And we don't even hit me. We haven't even hit our hard power spike yet. Need IE. I think I'm gonna go IE this game. On oh God. 
Man, are you fucking kidding me? I missed a goddamn cannon. Rank 1 Kaisa is bringing the fucking, the, the most, for, the former most OP build in the game back, baby. Love to see it, bro. I used to love this build, man. This build's really cool. I didn't even have a Gale Force that fight, by the way. Remember that, guys. I had to use Gale Force earlier to survive. You guys notice in that fight, I healed early to dodge the brand abilities, rather than waiting to heal. You guys want to heal early, with, like dodge ignite and brand abilities. Um... I think I wasted Gale Force, but I don't think they can Baron anymore. I'm gonna shove another one mid. Okay. Let that shove out. Clear his bot side jungle here. Take his Raptors. Alright, I have IE. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna shove one more wave mid. Just to keep Pryo, and then we're gonna recall here. What the hell? I don't know about this Panthal, but. He's dead. Uh, never mind, I'm dead. I shouldn't have followed that up. I should have followed, I shouldn't have followed that up. That's really bad on my part. They just get Baron for free now. Man, why is he so tanky? What is this? Oh well. Not the end of the world, but he does get a lot of a lot of gold. Alright, do we get Zanya's next? I think we do Zanya's next. I think Zanya's is the last item. Lord Dom's could be good too. I think Lord Dom's is probably more value than Zanya's. That was just a bad death from me. I, I shouldn't have helped him. I just gave him 1k. That's really bad for us. He's going to go ahead and get his Magi's now. He took no damage, though. I didn't have IE, to be fair. Like, me dying there is bad because I don't have my Power Spike yet. If I had Power Spike, I'd probably kill him there. Yeah, most likely. whole team is just tilted at each other. I was spared for a reason. We just really need a CC Echo. Uh, for some reason Echo's still mid. I have IE so I clear these really fast. Really, really bad champion that uh shutdown. How does he even have a goal? Wait, how do you have a shutdown? What's that guy done all game? Yeah, see, that's why Nidalee sucks. If she doesn't hit spear, she's just a really worthless character. Um, and that's the main problem with her. That's why you don't like just funnel gold in Nidalee ever. He didn't ult. But it's not bad. No, I flashed too late, bro. Oh, he lives. Orn TP'd here and not top. I didn't see the TP behind us. Man, I flashed too late. This would have been a great wit end game if I would have known Echo would have got this way. I, I saw him. I followed through with the build. I easily could have went wit end, but uh, it's okay. I could go Maw. Might be better just to go Maw. I think I can kill Orn no matter what if he's the last one alive. If we CC chain Echo, we can win 100%. Damn, he has fucking... Anya's now, man. That's a really this annoying. And honed by 
That's not what I meant by, uh... Your ult is always... Man, you can see it! That's not what I meant by CC Echo, dude. Um, I guess I go heal. I buy a pot too here and elixir. Damn, yeah, maybe I stalled long enough? I think I stalled long enough, maybe? Pants up in six. Oh, how are you dying, bro? All you have to do is clear the wave, buddy. Maybe? Damn, everybody has Zanyas. I don't. They just need to clear the wave. Oh, no, he's dead now. Oh, we lost. I think. Oh, unless? Ah, uh, nah, it's over. Damn it, bro. Oh, man. Oh, the game's unwinnable. Unwinnable. Some games you can't win, even in even in low elo like this. I think if I did a better build, it would probably would have been better if I went with send and a mom Amortius after my Navori. But that build can obviously work. I mean, I showed that it can work, but uh, my team was just too bad. I think like you can't you can't carry all your games, guys. So, but hey, I tried my hardest, and I hope you guys learned some things from the uh, from the wave management section. As you can see, I absolutely stomped Lucian. Um, he coin flipped this game completely. He's really bad. Um, yeah. Oh, well, you can't win them all, guys. Either way. Um, regardless, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys took some, some, you know, something from this wave management, uh, this wave management video. Kind of like a little guide for you, but, uh, yeah. If you gave me a chance.